Hi there, my name is Emily and I work at the Olympia to Berlin Library. Today we are going, we are in for such a special treat. We are going to learn how buses work. We're going to meet someone who works at the inner city transit maintenance facility where the buses are like fixed up so they're up and running for you and they're going to show us tools and lift up a bus and just generally show us all of the secrets that happen there. I'm so excited. And then at the end of the video, we are going to sing a song together with my coworker Chris. My coworker Chris made this really great song. He wrote it and it's called On the Bus. And so to get ready to sing On the Bus, we are going to learn some American Sign Language words that he uses in the song. So what we'll do today, our plan. First, we'll learn those songs. Uh -huh. We'll learn those words, I'm sorry. We'll learn some of the words in American Sign Language that Chris uses in his song. And then we will go meet the inner city transit maintenance team and see how buses are fixed up and worked on and the mechanics of all of that and then we'll come back together and we'll have a sing-along for on the bus <laughs> are you ready let's go all right let's learn some sign language words to help us sing the song Hey, Kyle. <laughs> Sign language for cat. You make your cat whiskers. <laughs> All right, this is the first word that's in the song. It's the word go. You point your fingers up towards the destination, towards where you want to go. Go. Let's go over here. Let's go over there. Ride. So you make a C. You can make a C. And then you turn it sideways and you take these fingers, your index and your middle finger, and you ride them on the thumb and you move your hand forward. Ride. Bus. Make your letter V. We got a peace sign and bend them down, bend your fingers like that. And then, you know those cords on the bus? We're going to pull our cord back for our bus stop. Ding! Bus. All right. This is bus stop. Bus stop. So we're going to make our bent V and pull it back. And then stop, you bring your right hand down onto your left palm. Stop, it has two parts. So bus, stop. There, point over there. Over there, just point where there is. <laughs> Here, point down to where you are twice. Anywhere, any, this is another two part word. So you're going to make a letter A, but put your thumb up and then you're gonna turn it and rotate it counterclockwise. So it's to the side. And then the word where, you put your pointy index finger up and you waggle it around. So any, where? Anywhere. Room. So this one, you put your palms, they're both facing down, but then one of them is like circling above the other. Room. It's like there's space. There's room for us. Us. So you use your index, your pointy finger, and you tap your right chest and your left. Us. Us. 
us wait hands in front of you and their palm this part is facing up and you kind of hold them to the side and you wiggle <laughs> that's wait isn't it fun to wait okay so the number one like this right that's how I usually say the number one but in American Sign Language you actually you hold your index finger up like this but you turn it around so that these fingers are facing towards your body and this one's facing towards the person you're talking to one one All right. so this is around and so we're gonna flip our one around like that <laughs> so this is like that one but flipped around and then the other hand is waving above it around <laughs> long all right stretch out your arm because you're going to starting at your wrist drag your index finger up your other arm long so long song that rhymes with long. So one hand is going to be in front of your body, palm facing up, and then that, like that. The other one is going to wave above it, like a conductor making music. Song. So if it's a quiet, slow song, you can go. And if it's a really, really fast wild song you can go <laughs> song bye right hand is going to be against your chest and then your other hand the left hand comes back to meet it bye beach or sometimes we might say seashore like we say in the song so this one, your palms are both down, this part facing down, and then your left hand comes over and down the right like a wave. Are you ready to crash it down? Like whoosh, whoosh. Seal. There are multiple ways to say the word seal in American Sign Language, but this one is my favorite. It's really fun. <laughs> right, so you're gonna cross your hands together like this at the wrist, the so cross hands at your wrist, and then clap them together. Clap the backs of your hands together like flippers. Seal. More. Make your letter O's and squish them, and then bring them together in front of you. Like they're giving a kiss, right? More. Dark. So we are going to have our palms in facing our body and we're going to bring our hands down in front of us like you are pulling down the shades on a window. So dark. Pull down the window blinds and it's going to go dark in here. Play. So you make the letter Y. Kind of like a shaka symbol, right? Make the letter Y and then shake it. Both hands. Play. Home. Okay, so make your letter O, right? And then squish it. Kind of like what we did with more. But just one O. And you're going to tap your cheek twice. So you'll tap your cheek once by your corner of your mouth and then another time up here by your ear so you don't have to make the kissing noise but it's fun <laughs> home and that's it we're ready to do sign language first i think we should learn 
a little bit more about how buses work, right? Should we take that tour now? Let's go. Welcome to the Inner City Transit Maintenance Facility. This is where we clean and repair all of our buses. Let's head downstairs for a better look. This is Joe. He's one of our mechanics who will be showing us around the shop today. First, he's going to show us how the bus lift works. As you can see, he's pressing that button and then the lift raises the bus. <laughs> That's so cool! Once the bus is in the air, the mechanics can go underneath to easily access the parts they need to clean and fix, like the transmission and the engine. Joe's pointing at the transmission there. Will you help me count how many tires are on the bus? One, two, three, four, five, six. Wow, six tires, that's a lot. Now Joe's lowering the bus back down. Since buses are so big, mechanics like our friend Joe need to sometimes use really big tools. That's a regular size wrench. And that's the one they use to work on the buses. And that is a normal size torque wrench. And that's the size they use to work on the buses. Everything is bigger on a bus. The tire to the right is a bus tire, and the one to the left is a car tire. Look how much bigger that tire is. And look at this cool thing. We call this the tire carousel. It's where we store all of our tires. Being a mechanic can sometimes be a dirty job. This is the room where the mechanics clean the underside of the bus. They put on one of these rain jackets, lift the bus up into the air, and spray the underside clean. These are the shop bikes that the mechanics can use to go to lunch. Or if they want to stay in, we always have some hot popcorn on hand. Speaking of our mechanics, these are some of their awesome awards. These are some of the training tools that our mechanics use. There sure is some technical stuff on a bus, that's for sure. This is a bus engine, and of course, it's really big. Sometimes the mechanics need to remove the engine to fix it. And if you're like me and was wondering, but wait, how do they get the engine out of the bus? They use this crane to lift it out. These are some really cool lasers that they use to help level the bus. And this is the mini bus that we like to take to parades. Unfortunately, it doesn't carry as many people as a regular bus. This is our good friend Carmen and the tool she uses to clean the inside of the bus. And this is the bus wash. It's like a giant bubble bath. Let's check it out from the inside. It's so cool in here. Wow, that's one shiny bus. Now that the bus is all fixed up and clean, it's ready to go back on the road. Thanks so much for coming to visit us. We had fun showing you our maintenance facility and how we fix and clean our buses. We hope to see you on the bus soon. That was so much fun. Thank you for the tour, Inner City Transit. That was so great. Are you ready to sing along using your American Sign Language words with Chris and I? Let's go for a ride on the bus. Let's go for a ride on the bus. All right. 
That's love for a ride on a bus. There's room There's on board for all of us. It'll take us from there to here or just about anywhere. Let's go. Let's go. City Transit Walk and Roll um, story times together. We learned about being a safe pedestrian, about riding our bikes safely, about how to ride the bus and how buses work. That was so fun. I hope to see you around on all of the adventures. <laughs> all right. I'll see you next time. Bye. <laughs>